Well, here it is. 16 horsepower, single cylinder, bridge and stratton, cast iron bore. Engine. Model number 326432. We put a little soap of water to this and we cleaned it up for dexterity purposes. This engine is powering a 4000 watt generator which produces 33 amps at 120 volts and 17 amps at 240 volts. The inspection plate right there. This unit came factory equipped with a L520 twist receptacle, a straight blade, 5-50, 120 volt receptacle, 240 volt L6-20 twist lock receptacle, and a 15 amp duplex receptacle. This unit came with a two and a half gallon fuel tank, which gives me four hours of run time with a medium load, three quarter load, you can also say. Four hours. And with a lighter load, I get five hours out of it. I use fully synthetic oil with a synthetic oil stabilizer. This unit was bought in the mid-1980s and been with me for quite a while. This engine is a war horse. Note, this gas-fired equipment, or any gas-fired equipment, produces carbon monoxide and shall not be ran indoors. They also had made by a licensed electrician a 120 volt panel which has a 30 amp main breaker on it which protects the generator which runs at 33 amps and I have two independent 20 amp circuits for handling my needs. Your needs may differ also equipped with the 50 amp straight blade. I do not believe in backfeeding my electrical panel in my home. I do not want to kill a utility worker on a pole, burn down my house, or hurt and maim others. I have no problem with extension cords. Let's start this bad boy up.
to recently I ran this generator for 12 straight days continuously I was burning approximately 15 gallons a day in fuel if you're planning on purchasing a permanent standby generator or even a portable generator strongly suggest that you consult with a professional engineer, registered architect, licensed master electrician, and or a licensed master plumber for a safe installation. Ah, what the heck, again, let's start this thing up. horsepower Briggs and Stratton gasoline engine the war horse of all war horses thank you for watching